What's going on everybody? In this video I'm going to show you what the offensive playbooks of the NFC East teams are going to look like in Madden 19. So this is the sixth of the eight divisions that I'll be doing, so be sure to check out the others if you want to see what the other division playbooks will be looking like for this upcoming season. So first up we have the infamous Dallas Cowboys who return an offensive playbook that looks very similar to that of the Madden 18 version with the two additions of weak eye wing and gun trips tight end offset. Uh, you know, two formations that are probably average to above average. I'd say overall it's an improvement, although it's hard not to be when you gain two formations without losing any. Uh, formationally, I would say at first glance they have a pretty solid playbook, especially for people who like to run like five wide sets as they have four different uh, five wide formations. Aside from that, they have a decent set of gun and single back formations along with the, you know, quote unquote H packages uh, throughout their I form sets, which does give them you know some different plays that normal sets uh, don't have along with the fullback being in a two-point stance rather than a traditional three-point so uh, that's some unique things that you'll be seeing in that Dallas Cowboys playbook now next up we have the returning Super Bowl champion Philadelphia Eagles in terms of changes they had a lot of kind of lateral moves like doubles flex to doubles Y flex and wing stack to wing slot offset the biggest change is probably the removal of the single back deuce y flex formation from the game and the addition of the single back tray formation uh, to this playbook so uh, last year this was one of the better playbooks in the game in my opinion with key formations you know such as gun bunch weak and deuce close that were very good last year obviously along with some very nice single back multi tight end sets to scheme out of um, so going into mad 19 i would say this book returns as definitely an above average option Third up, we have the New York Giants, who have seen massive changes with the overhaul of their coaching staff. I talked about them in the Most Changed Playbooks video as they saw uh, the introduction of 23 new formations and they lost 21 old ones. The biggest change is moving from a completely pretty much single back scheme, uh, they only had one I-form set last year, to that of a more a traditional two back power set type of playbook um, to look more like a traditional you know NFL style uh, they added in seven new I form variations at the expense of now having four less shotgun and two less single back sets uh, so overall I'd say you know it's a pretty average playbook going into Madden 19 it just kind of blends in with the crowd a little more and isn't as unique in my opinion Lastly, we have the Washington Redskins offensive book. Washington saw a few changes, but in the end came out better than last year in my opinion, as they not only gained more formations than they lost, but they also gained overall just straight up better formations. Uh, they are now one of only three playbooks that contain the shotgun wing pair formation, uh, which is a unique three tight end set that you know isn't under center. I believe it's the only one of that kind in the game. And they are also now only one of four teams who have the shotgun tight doubles formation, which has been historically a solid formation just you know in years past so uh, with those two key additions along with returning the core from last year i would say that they are in good shape going forward so that's going to be it for this video guys for the nfc east as always thank you so much for watching and be sure to subscribe for a ton of madden 19 content for the upcoming season and until next time take it easy